Huh? What's going on? Didn't you hear what we said last week? I want a fucking answer today! <laughs> Please, it's not exactly possible right now. It better be fucking possible! With how fast your management costs are rising, of course your protection's gonna cost more! N no Tuck, those thugs are Matsugane. No doubt about it. Agreed. Maybe you should, uh, help or something. A guy looks like he could use a hand. You could at least try to sound interested? Just hurry up and get it over with. I think you've had enough fun for one day. Huh? The fuck? Wait, that's Yagami! The hell are you doing here? My question first. Why are you threatening the civilian? None of your fucking business! Ugh, watch the volume. Or is yelling the only thing a dumb guy like you can do? Oh, that must be why you're bottom of the ladder. It all makes sense now. You little... I'll slaughter you! Listen up. <laughs> Go tell your precious Captain Hamura that Yagami was here. Got that? <laughs> Captain Hamura? Just do it. You know, Tak, this strategy's pretty solid, huh? Well, we'll find out soon enough. You know any other Matsugane joints, Kaito-san? We should hit a few just to be safe. There's Romance of the Three Kingdoms over on Pink Street. Fantastic Romance on West Shichifuku. And, uh, oh, Sweet Billow on East Shichifuku. All right, I'll try all of them. So, this is Romance of the Three Kingdoms? How about stopping in for a round, pal? We got the finest girls to satisfy any kink. Do you work here? Yeah, just come on in, buddy. I'll give you a great deal. This is a Matsugane place, right? Huh? What are you... I, uh... I don't want any trouble, man. It's not like that. Just tell your boss Yagami stop by. Uh, I'm not sure I follow. Just do it, okay? I gotta go. So, this is Sweet Billow, huh? Meaning the guy puffing away over there is probably an employee. Why don't you quit standing around and go find out? Someone's bossy today. Just do it, Talk. Yeah, yeah. 
Hey, you work here? I do. Why? Let me ask you something. This is a Matsugani establishment, right? Who are you? The name's Yagami. Don't worry, I won't stick around much longer. Just tell your boss I dropped by to say hello. And why is that? Look, just tell him, okay? I gotta run. This place is fantastic romance. Huh? It's good to see you, gentlemen. Don't good to see you, me. You're late on your payment and you know it. I'm sorry, sir. Our sales haven't been the best this month. You work on your pitch. Just being open's not enough to bring in customers. Looks like you're right on time, Talk. Go on, introduce yourself. Yeah, sure. Excuse me, are you guys open? Welcome, sir. We... What the... Yagami! Oh, are you from the Matsugane family? It's good to see you. Who the fuck do you think you are, strolling up on us like it's no big deal? I want to see Captain Hamura. Know where he is? You little shit. Who do you think you're talking to? You're never meeting Hamura. Cause you're gonna die right here! Satisfied? Damn it! If you know what's good for you, you'll report this to your family. I'm out of here. Yo, Kaito. That was freaking amazing talk. Yeah, you think? Yep, absolute perfection. Hummer will have guys on your ass in no time. Just keep walking around town. Won't be long till they jump you. Got it.
Yo, talk. Why don't you head somewhere with less people hanging around? Those Matsugane assholes aren't dumb enough to jump you with so many witnesses in sight. Where'd you have in mind? I was thinking the Champion District. The streets are so narrow there, they'll be more than happy to ambush you. Well, that's a scary thought. But okay, I'll head over now. Stuff. Back to it. Arigatouございました. I swear it's like... Like I can feel someone watching me. Are you there? your body. Kaito-san. Come on, man. Why would you bring more? him talk. Make him cough up all he knows about Hamura. Got it. You won't get away.
You're out of options. Hey, I got him. Okay, I know you work for Hamura. I want to know where he is. When he finds you, you're dead. Yagami. Is that so? What the... You should really see the look on your face right now, Kaito. Hamura. I gave you every chance to walk away from this. You just couldn't mind your own business, could you? And now you're gonna die for it. You pushed this one too far. Hamura. <laughs> Killing you is gonna feel real good. Is this really necessary? Don't make this harder than it needs to be, okay? Don't you think? I've pulled enough of the family's weight already. Please don't. I don't care how much like sons these two are to you. Your loyalty is to the Matsugane family first. Besides, you know there's no other way. Are you out of your fucking mind? You need to lower the gun right now! No, Kaito! You shut your goddamn mouth! Kaito! Kaito son! Yagami son! Kaito son! No, don't! We have to get out of here! You fuck! Stop right there! I think we lost them. What about Kaito-san? Hamura shot him in the stomach. So we'd have to carry him out. After that, I don't know. Damn it. We gotta go after him. Hold on. How'd you know where we were? I was sitting in the van listening in on the Matsugane office. They all rolled out, so I followed. Do you know where Hamura's hold up then? Maybe they dropped a hint while you were listening. Hmm. I did hear them mention the Soleil building once or twice. You think that's where they took Kaito-san? Can't say for sure. He could be anywhere, really. But it's worth looking into. It sounded like Soleil's been abandoned for a while. We can second-guess ourselves later, then. Let's get moving. Sounds good.
That's it. The Soleil building. Hold on. I recognize those guys out front. They're Matsugane for sure. Does that mean Kaito-san's actually in there? Hard to tell from out here. Looks like they're guards down, though. Guess we just gotta bust in, then. The sooner the better. You ready, Yagami-san? Yeah, let's do it. Hey, that's... Yagami! You got balls showing up around here! Let's go, Yagami-san. Okay. Almost there. That'll do it. What the? Yagami! some time, boys. Do whatever it takes. Hey! Ah! 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 Ah!
Damn it! Gonna have to try something else. Can't fight like this. Find the light switch, Yagami san. Give me a second. <sighs> Thanks. there. Nice. Almost there. Nice. Tougher than he looks. Keep it busy, boys. Hey!
Yagami san! Let me guess, turn the lights on? Can't you do it yourself? Give up. Get in there, boys. Hey! Almost there. Nice. Almost there. Got it. Finally. I was getting bored of waiting. Sugiura! Don't worry about me! Just go find Kaito-san! You think I'd let you do that? <laughs> I'm done playing. 
Time to go in for the kill! Amara. Surprised you decided to stick around. Not gonna try to run? Go fuck yourself, Doc. Let him go right now. Ha. <sighs> what makes you think you have the upper hand here? Kaito-san. <laughs> hey. He sounds worried. Oh! You piece of shit! You asked for it. This time, let's finish it for real, asshole. That all? Just need a minute, Kaito-san. Sure, what's the rush? <laughs> this what you want? I'm gonna fucking kill you! Is it over, Yagami-san? <sighs> yeah. Glad you're okay. Come give me a hand. How do you feel, Kaito-san? <sighs> what, me? It was just a scratch. <sighs> I'm good on my own. <clears throat> Still acting tough with lead in your stomach? Who are you trying to impress? 
Yo, let me jump in too. Higashi. Matsugani-san too. My van's right outside. You two get him to a doctor. There's something I still need to do here. Got it. Guess I'm joining your little party. Not even the threat of death can stop you guys. <laughs> Took you long enough. <coughs> hey, uh, it's about time you give us some answers. Uh, I'm done wasting time on you, so just cooperate and it'll all be fine. Uh, uh, what, your murderer friend abandon you? Not much use if he won't come when you need help. Boss, listen. Things are gonna get ugly if I die here. Neither of you will survive the aftermath. It's not too late to put a stop to this. Just end this fucker and be done with it. And if I don't, the mole will kill us both. Is that what you're saying? Look, some people you can get away with betraying. And some people you can't. And which am I, I wonder? Boss. Pick your poison, Hamura. You die betraying the mole, or you die defending him. <coughs> We're going to bring this murderer to justice. Now tell me where I can find him, and his identity. Answer me! I'd rather die. What? Don't play dumb with me. You think I'm gonna talk that easy? Pull the fucking trigger! If you say so. <clears throat> huh. Didn't think you'd really stand your ground. <sighs> we can't stay here. Who knows when his backup might arrive. Are the Matsugani still after us? Most likely. Embarrassing as that is to admit. Well, guess we gotta figure out how to make you talk. Huh? Luckily, I've got a place in mind. You heard of the Honmaruen Cabaret? It's a Kyore stronghold. What? I'm sure your former prey will be thrilled to see you. If they can't break you, I don't know what can. I doubt you'll last, though. It'll be damn interesting either way. Now come on, let's go. <laughs> Here he is, the man of the hour. Glad you could make it, Hamura. And you must be Patriarch Matsugane. It's a pleasure to meet you. <laughs> Though if you ask me, dojo leadership should be better at keeping their dogs chained up. Agreed. There is no excuse for how I acted. shioya san we're gonna make Hamra tell us who the Mole is. Think you can keep us safe till then? <laughs> maybe. Maybe not. This is what Chairman Kajihiro wants. You don't want to disobey his orders, do you? Well, that's rude. I still haven't paid you back for what you did to me. If you don't mind, I'd like to settle that first. For what I did? You're the one who kidnapped Mafuyu. If you ask me, you got what was coming to you. <laughs> Fine. Under one condition. What? Once you're done with him, you give Hamura to us. <laughs> Gladly. What, no witty comeback? I think that's a first for you. 
shut it. AD-9's dark human experiments. The mole who facilitated them. As Yagami gets closer to the truth, the trap is sprung. Details come at the cost of Kaito's blood. And each word that Hamura, the Matsugane family captain, speaks pulls back the veil a little further. Get your fucking hands off me! This is as good a spot as any. You need any... instruments. You just ask me. Hopefully, it doesn't come to that. Now, I think it's about time we got some answers. And you're gonna give them to us. Should we take it from the top? First off, the one in control of all this is Shono, the 89 researcher. How long have you been working for him? murdering for him. I already have a pretty good idea. How about I guess? <laughs> First time you used the mole was... Kyori clan guys who turned up dead. Their eyes were gouged out, and the bodies dumped in the alleyways. Yeah, real solid detective work there. Yo, Yagami, that doesn't feel right. I mean, look at that shit-eating grin. Uh, yeah, right. Uh, let me think here. What the shit, man? Now, the first time you used the mole was... the vice director of the ADDC. He got beat to death six months ago, as you well know. <laughs> Hashki had a secret deal with Chairman Kajihiro. Together, they were gonna poke holes in this 89 business and bring the ADDC to its knees. But Shono, the researcher in charge of the drug, had a big secret he needed to keep hidden. Hashki's little investigation posed a big problem. That is, until he got beaten down in the back streets of Kamurocho. Hashki was fatally wounded by the mole and survived for another three weeks. That kept suspicion off Shono and left practically no evidence. Only the most skilled killer could pull something like that off. In other words, the assassin you and Shono had been using. <laughs> Think you struck a nerve. You're a real crack detective, Yagami. You know, I personally funded his time at law school. He never would have passed the bar without me. No shit. I'd say you made a good investment. Paying off in spades. Uh, do you mind? I'm kinda in the middle of something here. Sorry. Sorry. So, where's your friend? No clue. But he'll be here soon enough. All three of you are dead where you stand. He says the mole's on his way here. Oh, is he now? 
I'd love to have a chat with the lad. Keep dreaming, pal. He'd wipe the floor with your backcountry ass. Enough, Hamra. Tell us who the mole is and how you started working with him. Have those instruments handy? Coming right up. All right, all right, I'll talk. That's almost a shame. I like when it's tool time. Now, who is the mole? At first, he was just an informant feeding off the chaos that breeds in Camarocho like flies. An informant? Yep, and he was trained by one of the best in the business. Rose to prominence after the cops busted his mentor. And that made the mole the top guy in the biz. One of those situations where the students surpassed the master. Nobody could beat his intel. Could get his hands on anything you needed to. Guns, forged documents, you name it. Before long, we'd formed a nice little partnership. Started making a name for ourselves. Thinking about it, it's been about 20 years now. And? Keep talking, or it's tools. Once I got the gig as captain of the Matsugane family, I started relying on them even more. Let me tell you, the guy could dispose of a corpse like it was the easiest damn thing in the world. He had nerves of steel. And he's never even sworn up. Flash forward to a couple years ago, he said he was ready to start doing hits. That's when my... <laughs> Big chance finally came. Honestly, I wasn't that big on the whole murder thing. But the dangerous shit's what really brings in the cash. So, I started touting his services around the darker side of Kamaroto. <laughs> Felt like I added a new dish to my menu. This is no time for jokes, you fool. What, you don't approve of my methods? This city will swallow you whole if you don't got the cash. And protecting the family name doesn't come cheap. Ha! <sighs> you think Kaido could have toughed it out with all his swagger? We'd have vanished by now. But with enough money, who knows? We could have rode it to the top of the Tojo clan. Wasn't that always part of the dream, boss? It was, yes. But not anymore. Ah, uh, that's so. <laughs> that's funny, because I spent my entire life chasing that dream for you! The goal you fucking told me to strive for! Let's get back on topic, shall we? Tell me this. You started shopping the mole services around. What then? What happened? <sighs> Wasn't long till we got our first hit. Our mark was Hoshki, vice director of the ADDC. And Shono's the one who hired you? So I heard. He always contacted me through someone else. guy by the name of Ishimatsu. Short little guy. Always had this creepy fucking smile on his face. At the time, we all thought this was gonna be a one-off. Didn't do much prying, you know. Never even knew why they wanted the guy dead. We just took the 10 mil and did what we were asked. They wanted him to die discreetly though, right? Pretty much. So he did. Ishimatsu took a real shine to us after that. A few months later, he was back with another job. And that was? Well, gathering test subjects for their 89 experiments. And disposing of the bodies. <laughs> 